Hey folks, welcome back to my channel. Let's begin without further ado. The 2025 Toyota Highlander thus sits perfectly in between the RAV4 and the Grand Highlander models to give families with extra space needs than a mid-size vehicle provides the perfect SUV to own. Even if the last major redesign was done five years ago, it is possible to expect a slight restyling of the exterior and interior. Under the hood, the Highlander comes with a tooth. The current engine is a four-cylinder turbocharged engine that has an option of a 2.0 liter or 2.5 liter engine, which has a horsepower of 265 horsepower and a torque of 310 LBFT of torque has replaced the V6 engine. This is a turbocharged engine and while on the high side in power provides the same high energy efficiency when driving in the city, which aids it over other midsize SUVs that are designed with V6 engines. The economy is another plus as Highlander with all wheel traction rates and EPA offered 25 meter per G on the combined scale, while those with the front driver system earned 26 MPG on the same scale. Real world testing proved to be even more impressive. On the evaluation routes, this is rated at 6 MPG. For those who want to save the most of their fuel, the Highlander Hybrid model is the one to consider with 36 MPG combined. On the inside, specifically made with family comfort in mind. The first two rows can seat, and the second row captain's chairs add comfort on long trips if ordered. The third row is, however, better suited to children and is quite low to the ground. Nevertheless, there aren't many noises seeping through the cabin from the wheels and the wind for comfortable and quiet driving. The Highlander's technology is easy to use. It comes with a standard eight inch touchscreen, which supports Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, and Amazon Alexa a three inch display and a JBL audio system. Although the system is quite user friendly, there could be some users who might be confused by the interface being a bit cluttered. Safety is a big concern and Toyota offers a whole range of driver aids like adaptive cruise control and lane keeping assist across all trim levels. It has slim front roof pillars to improve visibility, which combined with the addition of the camera based rear view mirror and the new surround view camera system. These aspects provide a simpler way of handling the Highlander, especially when carrying a fully laden complement of passengers and loads. The current and latest generation of Toyota Highlander has not been produced for the newest model of 2025. However, it will be assumed that the mid-range XLE model will be cheap. This trim is affordable, but boasts some good features that make it appropriate for the midsize SUV for those families. All in all, the 2025 Highlander has all it takes to remain a serious player in the midsize SUV market as it delivers all that is expected of today's family vehicle.